Every time I hear somebody say I believe, it makes me cringe inside. Council of the Americas, founder and honorary chairman, David Rockefeller. So I cringe a lot. The Americas Society, chairman, David Rockefeller. <laughs> the Forum of the Americas, founder, David Rockefeller. Thing, well, what? No, hold it. The Institute for International Economics, financial backer and board member, David Rockefeller. Believe. The Trilateral Commission, founder and honorary chairman, David Rockefeller. See, I come from people who have beliefs. And I'm a part of those beliefs, and I respect those beliefs, because they're part of my reality. But then on the other hand... Vice President, uh, I just enjoyed so much your whole speech, but I was particularly pleased that you gave such a strong endorsement for the free trade agreement for all the Americans. This thing has been going on for like 3,000 years. <laughs> you know, everybody's been protesting and standing up to see, but, but as, it as it gets us, and all those our perception of, of self and reality, right? The same old struggles come. It's just a new generation saying new words, dancing to new music, to new instruments. It's good to be back at the Council on Foreign Relations. As uh, Pete mentioned, I've been a member for a long time and was actually a director for some period of time. I never mentioned that when I was campaigning for re-election. Misuse of a word here. It's on the wrong sound out in the vibratory world. In harmony, <laughs> right? The sound. And I think believe might be a word that's not in harmony, although that's the illusion that's been created that we've been led to believe. But see, I think it's better to say either I know or I don't know, <laughs> or I think. I think. I have intelligence. I think. My intelligence has been drugged with <laughs> misinformation. My, my intelligence has been sent on a trip. <laughs> I'm tripping, so I believe. <laughs> Huh? I mean, can we understand it that way? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but it's the same old thing. Check out a little bit of Paris or France in 1430. <laughs> Check that place out, man. Right? It's the same thing. Check out the rise of industrial civilization or the, the industrial revolution in America in the 1800s. Same thing. So the same struggle by the human beings to just try to be, stay alive right, has been going on for a long time. It's us who are being mined, so we need to interfere with that mining process. So it's more passive, right? Believing. And I think we should respect our intelligence and it should always be active. Right? We should be active. If we can create our own daily insecures and miseries and fears, we can use that same intelligence to create a whole much better reality, I'm telling you. See, and the collective reality, all the causes and movements and the things that we feel are right and that we chase, see, that reality is not going to really change until we change this other one.